Today I'm going to take a look at elementary OS. Um, we're going to do it together actually. I've never installed it before. I've seen screenshots, a little video of the promo on their website, but other than that I haven't seen it at all. So I downloaded the 64-bit version and I put it in a VM telling it we're going to be running um, Debian 64-bit. Let's see if it's compatible. And I formatted a solid-state drive in my uh, SATA doc, so we'll install to that. So I mounted the ISO, gave it 4 gigabytes of RAM and a 20 gigabyte hard drive. Let's go ahead and hit play. And we'll just go ahead and full screen. It's now booting for the first time. Okay, that's kind of cute. Nice, simple. Yeah, from what I've seen, it looks a lot like Mac OS X. And people are, are saying that's bad for some reason, but Mac OS X's hot or nice looking. So I don't see it as a con. Okay, so it didn't detect my uh, video display. Oh, here we go. Cool. We're going to go ahead and say install it. Uh, four gigs, that's cool. Internet. Um, we're not going to say update while downloading. We'll just kind of speed it up here. Um, erase and install. Great. Blank VM. Okay, so far the OS screen is very Mac OS X like in there again. I don't see why it's a con. Um, Mac OS 10 looks great. Go ahead and copy the hell out of I mean, Apple might sue you, but I mean, take some. Most Mac OS versions just reek of looking like Unix or, or Linux. You can just tell it just has this look to it. Holy crap, look at that install go. Okay, we're going to go ahead and say continue. Your name. Let's call my name Bob. Hey, Bob. And I guess it's going to want a password. Let's just do the good old. Oh, don't like it. One, two, three, four, five, six. Let's do it one more time. One, one two, three, four, five, six. There we go. One, two, three, four, five, six. World's best password. Um, Auto in automatically, sure, why not? Continue. Okay, that's cute. It goes to the middle of the screen as I'm installing. So far, the UI looks really, uh, really good. So let's give it some time here. There again, I did it on a solid state drive, 30 gigabytes, and it's not very fast. It's set at two. Hey, it's almost finished copying files. Hooray. Can we look at it? See what it's doing? Well, that's... Hmm. Yeah, the total download came in just shy of um, 700 MB. So it's not bad. It's pretty standard. Hey, it's installing the system. Can I move that around, I wonder? Oh, cool. Okay, I told it not to do any updates while downloading or while installing. So it shouldn't do that. I don't know what it's retrieving exactly. Okay, well, so you guys aren't bored out of your minds. I'm going to go ahead and pause it, and I'll resume once it passes this step or this stage. Be right back.
Okay, now it's moving here, scanning. It's going pretty quick. Hey, time zone keyboard user, we're almost done. I hope. Now it's configuring the hardware. Hey, the bootloader. Let's do grub. Updating grub, removing packages, installing system again. Restoring previously installed packages, but they have never been installed before until just now. So, okay, let's go ahead and restart. There it goes. Come on, Mr. Restart. Finish installing. Okay, the auto reboot does not look like it's working, so let's go ahead and go into here. So now we're booting it back up here after the install. Let's go ahead and full screen it. Okay. I actually went through a 20 minute process of installing the VMware tools. There's a lot of learning the uh, terminal all over again, or terminal, a lot of swearing, and so I cut that out of there. So let's go in here underneath display. Let's up the display to. Is it going to work? Apply. Hey, we're full screen. Keep this configuration. So, let's see. Here is the OS. Ah, crap. Damn it. The video driver did not work yet. <sighs> Shit. I just spent half an hour getting the damn VMware and tools installed, and it looks like I still don't have any graphic acceleration. But let's do this for the video. I I like to do this anyway. Just come in here underneath um, um, where? Okay, displays. So basically what I want to do is turn off all the fade effects. It's usually the first thing to go on any OS that I install. It makes everything seem a little bit snappier. In this case, it's kind of slowing us down. Where would that be? Come on, I spent a half an hour installing VMware tools. And now... Okay, Bluetooth, not network, Bluetooth, sound, not that, 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 or the. I doubt it's color. It still has no idea what... 
Privacy language support. Desktop. Wait, let's go back here. Wait, startup applications. See? VMware, something's loading. Um, brightness lock. So that sucks. This whole video is going to be very uh, laggy. But so is life, I guess. So here's some of the stuff. Oh, my legs are starting to crap. Built into the OS. Let's see how sexy the calculator is. Six, six, six times six, six, six. There is Satan's brother. Okay. I really wish this was. Wait, actually, let's go back once. Okay, we got the calendar. <laughs> it's not bad. It almost looks like a direct rip from Mac OS X, but not as pretty. Uh, instant messaging, document viewer. If we open this up. Ooh, PDF, comic books. Nice. Ooh, is this a mail client? Let's see how hot that looks like. Okay, we're not going to sign into that. Oh, come on. At least show me what it looks like without me signing into it. Sure. What do you bet there is a bob at gmail.com? I'm just... Would Bob have used Bob as a password? Probably. I'm just kidding. One, two, three, four, five, six. Go figure. Well, I wanted to look at this without sending into an account. I hate when it does that. Here's the music app. <laughs> this looks like a freaking rip of iTunes. And it's awesome. I mean, it's the UI is great. I love how it goes to the border. Um, still leggy as shit, though. But Settings, we've been there. Software Center. Let's look at... Midoriya. Sounds like a mythical town in some fairy tale. Okay, is this like a Firefox clone or something, or did they write this themselves? About. A lightweight web browser. Let's go to the website. And come on. Hmm. Me Dory. Midori? Hmm. Okay, well that's interesting. So let's take a look at the App Store Software Center. Let's go ahead and open it up. So let's just for fun install VLC Media Player. Okay, we're gonna say um, I wish that was a little bigger. Let me guess, it wants my password again. Okay, overall the UI is not bad. I mean, there again, it's, it's ripping off OS 10, but there again, OS. 10 is not a very bad looking US. You know, I kind of put it to a key, and let's just say I had a friend, right? And his girlfriend was smoking hot, okay? But now let's say I found a girl in a bar that looked just like his girlfriend. Would that be so bad? That would mean this new girl I found was also hot. So, I don't see any problem with uh, an OS copying another good looking OS. What you get is something you very rarely see on a Linux distro, which is a very good looking OS. Sure, 
Mint and uh, Ubuntu are both good-looking OSs, but they still just ooze the fact that you're on Linux. And people might say, well, that's why I'm using Linux. Sure. But other people like the... Um... Oh, God, this UI is... People just want something... They would actually prefer they have an OS um, Linux distro that looks like OS X. All of the Linux, none of the Hackintosh. Oops, I wanted to bring that back up. Uh, I could probably dumb the UI down, the resolution, so it's a... Uh, Oh, come on, where's my install now? Okay, that went away, it hid. Where do I find the OS? See, that's installed. No, where's the progress bar of my, uh... Is it over here? No. Well, that's cute. That's nice. Um, <laughs> view. Oh, we can sync between two computers. Well, let's just assume it got almost done and it's going to finish. So let's bring this down. And VLC should be here. VLC. Hey, here it is. Go ahead and open it up. Ha! Huh. Even VLC looks sexy in this operating system. That is a hard feat to accomplish. I'd run a video right now, but given my uh, VMware Tools driver is not loading properly, it'd be pretty laggy. But, overall, I gotta say, I I'm impressed with the OS. It is nice looking, it is easy to use. Um, yeah, I think... Let's just see what Facebook looks like on here. I do like the edge to edge browser. That does look nice. So let's go to Facebook.com. Facebook. Duck, duck, go. Do Facebook right? Oh, I see. I did the control enter to add the dot com. Let's see. Facebook control enter. Nope, it does not work like that. So let's type out the entire URL. Yeah, the edge to edge browsing is nice, or the the in the edge to edge screen browser is nice. I mean, that's just my brief look at it. Um, I doubt there's going to be an extended version of this review because I spent probably a half an hour in the terminal window trying to get VMware tools installed. There's a lot of naughty words being said, so we'll just um, cut that part out. <laughs> Actually, when I did the reboot back into the OS as, quote, the first time, no, it was not the first time. The first time was me swearing at my machine, so I just kind of rebooted it. Once I thought that I got the driver installed and I'd have an actual um, hardware acceleration, which, <laughs> judging by the lagginess of this, I don't, so. Okay, well, let's go ahead and do a shutdown then. Hey, look, in comparison to Windows 8, it's not hidden, it's right in front of you. Okay, yeah, like Windows 8, bury your mouse in the frickin' corner, pull up, settings, power, this OS. Shut down. <laughs> Shut down. Anyway, that's just my brief look at elementary OS. Thanks for watching. Ah, my mouse is still locked in there, isn't it? Let go. There we go. Thanks for watching.